must see TV. Isn't that the slogan for some other network? Don't you think they're going to sue? Sue? See? That's the kind of news that makes me cry. Cry? Hey. Now cut that out. Don't miss the Latino Laugh Festival, premiering July 12th, only on Showtime. Showtime's three-day weekend. Tonight at 8, she's the postmodern, post-apocalyptic anti-hero for the new world. Lori Petty stars in the premiere of Tank Girl. Then at 10, it's another terrifying chapter in the battle between good and evil on Poltergeist, The Legacy. And at 11, a Secret Service agent looks to pull the plug on a pair of deadly android assassins in Cyber Tracker 2. This summer, Showtime's never been hotter. Showtime promises you a premiere movie every Friday night. Hollywood hits that you can't see anywhere else. Tonight, she's sassy. I'm gonna need a, a microscope and tweezers. It's like a... She's sexy. The glamour has left the building. She's the post-feminist, post-apocalyptic anti-heroine. Lori Petty and Malcolm McDowell in the Showtime Hollywood hit, Tank Girl. The following movie is rated R. It contains violence, adult language, and adult content. Viewer discretion advised. It takes only a moment. You gonna have sex with her? Give it to me, I love it. Only a moment to take a chance. We're not supposed to be leaving during school hours. We make our own rules. We go to the wind takes them. And from that moment, everything changes. And now you've met this girl and nothing else seems to matter. Matt, you gotta get her back here. The next song that comes on, if it's Western, we go north. If it's rock, we go south. Drew Barrymore and Chris O'Donnell in a moment of wild, dangerous, mad love. Premiering next Friday evening at 8 on Showtime. You're watching Showtime. Tonight at 10, it's another terrifying chapter in the battle between good and evil on Poltergeist, The Legacy. Then at 11, a Secret Service agent looks to pull the plug on a pair of deadly android assassins in Cyber Tracker 2. And at 12.40, the action continues when the world's first virtual criminal is unleashed in the thriller Hologram Man. This summer, Showtime's never been hotter. What's up on an all-new Sherman Oaks? Will the Bakers bond with their new neighbors? Brother, you wide tighter than the ass of a Buchanan voter. When hormones collide. What is this, National PMS Day? What can stop the vicious cycle? Some kindness, a little TLC. Of course, that takes way too much of my time, so I buy her a gift instead. Check out the show called The Best Adult Comedy on TV. Yo, I think we're starting to get to him, man. You're starting to get to me. On the next Sherman Oaks. Premiering Sunday evening at 11 o'clock on Showtime. Who are those kids rejects from hell? If you don't stand up, you can't walk down the street. Michelle Pfeiffer stars in the true life story of a teacher who broke the rules and changed their lives. There are no victims in this classroom. Dangerous Minds, coming in August, only on Showtime. This summer, there's never been bigger original pictures. Never been more new series. There's never been a hit season like this. This summer, Showtime's never been hotter. Showtime, Summer 96. I don't want to leave you like this. Pam, I am going to die. I'm sorry you had to see me like this, but you're just going to have to do what you got to do to forget. 
In the Showtime original picture, Beyond the Call, Sissy Spacek jeopardizes her marriage by fighting to save the life of an old boyfriend who's now on death row. At the time of the murder, he's on escape from the Glastonbury Correctional Facility here in Connecticut, where he's serving 15 to 28 years for manslaughter. Wow. Did you know all that about him? No. I hadn't seen him since high school. Beyond the Call is a fictional story inspired by actual events. She's married with two children, uh, has a real steady life, things are good, and then out of the blue, she's catapulted back to her past. David Strathairn plays Russell, a convicted murderer who responds when his first love reaches out. The first one where it really rocks you, you and gets inside you, that, that seems to be the seed of their, uh, their bond. I didn't come to see a prisoner. I knew you before all this. I loved you before all this. Let's just not start that again, okay? When things are a matter of life or death, you really look at what's important in your life. When, when, it's just like when all your loved ones are healthy and happy and living life, it's a real gift. Arliss Howard plays Keith, Pam's less than understanding husband. Go down there, be with him for a week. Hold his hand, go. I'm not leaving you, Keith. I'm just going to help somebody who really needs me. Go. For veteran filmmaker Tony Bill, Beyond the Call was an opportunity to explore the outer boundaries of the human heart. The sense that someone you knew well and cared for is suddenly changed overnight from your point of view into a monster, into something that he could not possibly be, but yet must be. That's very compelling. Sissy Spacek was deeply affected by the story behind Beyond the Call. I think a lot of times we get caught up in the world and we, f we forget to feel. We get into our little routine and we forget to really feel. I did love you. Why are you doing this? Sissy Spacek and David Strathairn star in the Showtime original picture, Beyond the Call. Premiering Sunday evening at 8 on Showtime. On the next Outer Limits, in a war between planets. We're under attack. A crippled spaceship is the Earth's last hope. They knew we were coming. Terminator 2's Robert Patrick. If anybody tries to board us, you detonate that warhead. Dances with Wolves' Graham Greene. Have you ever seen the enemy before? The big monster-looking things with scaly lizard skin. Ah! An all-new episode of the Showtime original series, The Outer Limits. Premiering Sunday evening at 10 o'clock on Showtime. On the next Rebel Highway. She's the newest member of the sorority, and she's one twisted sister. I wouldn't want us to be rivals. I don't mind the competition. She's bad. Do you mind if I cut in? She's trouble. That's her. <laughs> she's out of control. It is the true wizard. And when she gets angry, watch out. <laughs> Confessions of a Sorority Girl. <laughs> Alyssa Milano, Brian Bloom, Jamie Lunar on Rebel Highway. Tuesday evening at 8 o'clock on Showtime. So let's just I don't run the law. I am the law. Guilty. Let's try. I am the law. Armando Santé. Close it, Judge Dredd. Coming in July only on Showtime. Van harte gefeliciteerd, Showtime. That means happy birthday, Showtime, in Dutch. Happy anniversary, Showtime. Glad to be part of you. Hmm. I hope you have another great 20 years. Our last hope against evil is a secret society called The Legacy. I, I could feel myself being pulled deeper and deeper into the darkness. Nick's ex-girlfriend goes into a coma and falls prey to <gasps> evil forces. Can we at least pursue the possibility of some more rational explanation? Give me one. Now, only love can save her. Something bad is going on in this hospital, Rachel. Hold <laughs> the legacy. 
premiering next on Showtime. The Somebody to Love sequence kind of happened on the day that we did it. We knew that uh, Jim was going to, you know, Jim was going to do this number. Uh, what we did in the morning was Jim just, uh, we did a rehearsal of it. That was a gray slick uh, to the power of ten, basically, you know. I always was fascinated by her vibrato in that song, and so I just kind of took it and exaggerated it. One, two, three! When the truth is found to be light and all the joy within you You know, Jim did his thing, and then I just kind of basically went off of what Jim was doing. And, and at that point in the movie, we'd been working together for like about three months. I just thought S Somebody to Love was so perfect, the theme for this movie, you know. I mean, it's, it, it just worked out great. Hi, I'm Dizzy Plinton. I'm Paul Rodriguez. And of course, I'm Chief Marine. And we're here to invite you to an all-new Showtime series, Latino Laugh Festival. We like to think of it as must-see TV. Yeah. Wait a minute, must-see TV? Isn't that the slogan for some other network? Don't you think they're going to sue? Sue? Sí. Sue? Well, that's the kind of news that makes me cry. Cry? Yeah. Now cut that out. Don't miss the Latino Laugh Festival, premiering July 12th, only on Showtime. Sometimes the law works, and sometimes it doesn't. So now he's going to take the law into his own hands. And this time, give Mr. Kersey the warmest of them. He won't quit till he gets them all. Charles Bronson, Death Wish 5, The Face of Death. Saturday evening at 10 o'clock on Showtime. Dear Reggie. Dear Reggie. Dear Reggie. Some ladies find romance in glamorous places. Yes, ma'am. My dreams of passion came true on a slow train. A bed of straw with a man with nothing but the clothes on his back. My story will rattle those princesses right out of their penthouses. No one will ever know. No one but you, Red Shoes. Red Shoe Diaries, followed by The Erotic Zone. Saturday on Showtime. It was a headline that hit home. Dear old high school friend. He was a death row inmate. I don't know if you'll remember me the way I remember you. And her first love. You see, a guy who kills a cop wants to blame the war. And you're looking at some hot router you've been carrying a torch for for 20 years. I'm not carrying a torch for him, Keith. Now she's caught between two men. If you want to know what's going on with me, go see him. And to save the life of one... He's giving up. He's going to let them kill him. Russell, it's never too late. She may have to risk the love of the other. He's a dead man. In one week, he'll be dead. Then go. I don't care. Her choice may cost her everything. They're not going to kill the guy that you got locked up in your heart. Sissy Spacek, David Strathairn, and Arliss Howard in a fictional story inspired by actual events. The Showtime original picture, Beyond the Call. Premiering Sunday evening at 8 on Showtime. What's up on an all-new Sherman Oaks? Will the bakers bond with their new neighbors? Brother, you wired tighter than the ass of a Buchanan voter. When hormones collide. When is this? National PMS Day? What can stop the vicious cycle? Some kindness, a little TLC. Of course, that takes way too much of my time, so I buy her a gift instead. Check out the show called The Best Adult Comedy on TV. Yo, I think we're starting to get to him, man. You're starting to get to me. On the next Sherman Oaks. Premiering Sunday evening at 11 o'clock on Showtime. 
How far are we going to go this week, Don? Well, this week, Full Frontal Comedy confronts the important topics that beg to be discussed. So how many people think I look like Captain Kangaroo after a rough weekend? With a very select core of hand-picked comedians. This guy has enough chemicals in him to start a pharmaceutical company. And sophisticated acts that scream to be heard. I'm looking forward to this big moment. Expose yourself to an all-new Full Frontal Comedy. Premiering Sunday evening at 11.30 on Showtime. Man, I love this show. There's a championship belt waiting to be claimed. The WBO belt left by Riddick Bowe. Two men want it. Want it bad. Alexander Zolkin, Henry Akinwande. Zolkin, former Soviet amateur champion and number one contender, puts his 24-2 pro record on the line against undefeated 6'7", number two ranked Akinwande. One crown, two heavyweights. Zolkin versus Akinwande, Saturday, June 29th, on Showtime Championship Boxing. I don't like hiding. I'm not asking you to hide. Just sleep in the other bedroom while my parents are in town. That's hiding. It's hiding who I am, who we are, our life. It's easy for you. You're totally open about your life. I work at it. Sooner or later, you're going to have to let the world know you're a lesbian. I am not a lesbian. Oh, really? I've never been with another woman except for you. I love you. I'm attracted to you. Nothing else about me is a lesbian. Most people would agree that's enough. Are you ready for Bedtime? A new series coming in July only on Showtime. You're watching Showtime. Tonight at 10, it's another terrifying chapter in the battle between good and evil on Poltergeist, The Legacy. Then at 11, a Secret Service agent looks to pull the plug on a pair of deadly android assassins in Cyber Tracker 2. And at 12.40, the action continues when the world's first virtual criminal is unleashed in the thriller Hologram Man. This summer, Showtime's never been hotter. The following presentation is not rated. It contains violence, adult language, and adult content. Viewer discretion advised. 